What is up boys and girls, guys and gals, ladies and gentlemen, this is D22 with you today from the D22 Responses channel and this is going to be another walkthrough video on Sony Vegas Pro. This is Sony Vegas Pro 13. Just off the bat I'm going to give you the specs of my operating system. Windows 8.1. This is a Dell Inspiron 17 series computer with a 16 gigabyte RAM set. 1 terabyte hard drive and a 2 gigabyte Nvidia GeForce graphics card. So this is a monster of a computer that I have. I upgraded recently and I feel pretty good about it. So, right down to the nitty gritty of the program. So, what we're going to do is we're going to see if there's any changes in the menu. So, we're going to go to File and then, usually this is all pretty standard. Your new open close and then all your previous products that you've done here were all the way down. And we're going to go Import media media from project AAF whoa premiere and after effects that's right you can import from various other project files so you need premiere or after effects to do that and there's Final Cut Pro 7 Final Cut Pro X and EDL and this is all the same stuff but you can cross module or you can cross edit between projects now that's really cool and then you can export between Final Cut Pro, After Effects, Final Cut X, and PSP. That's like for PlayStation. Well, Sony, probably. And for the edit, they have the editing tools over here. And notice that the tools used to be up here. Now they've moved it down here. You've noticed that in the previous versions of Sony Vegas, that all the tools were up here I think it was but they also have it near the playback area here and also near the top where they had the editing tools at the top I remember this function because they had the editing tools up on the top where you had your normal your envelope edit selection edit and zoom edit they were all up here before they've moved it all the way down and also for the tools there are ways that you can burn disks and all this stuff it's all, it's all the same stuff initially but it has a lot of functions and features that most other editors are integrating now I have three editors on my computer hit film express after effects CC6 and after effects CC I should say and also Vegas Pro 13 so initially it's all the same from the previous version then you can go for Vegas Pro connect and then you can share online it's generally the same generally the same interface same look same editing tools but there's a lot of differences in project exporting and also working with different various formats so that's really cool and I have been using this and it just feels like the same Vegas Pro that I've known and love and I have another tutorial on how to use Vegas Pro in its entirety editing importing videos and all that stuff in the annotation right where you see it and also the description below so you can click on those if you are a mobile user if you're using this from a phone or a tablet or a phablet or your laptop or your desktop whatever top that you're wearing just don't take your top off but that is where you can go and check it out and that's pretty much it this isn't really a how-to video per se this is just a walkthrough of the new features in Vegas Pro that are on the version 13 and then what you can do so you won't see any editing here it's just me talking to a screen and just zooming in on some things so that's it get fueled for life and I'll respond to you another time take care guys bye bye guys and gals bye bye